and the youth department that caused us to be here tonight. Okay, Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. I give you all for a late greeting. Bless the name of the Lord. And also to the youth, I'm giving you a wonderful greeting, Wednesday night greeting. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Surely tonight my heart is indicting a good matter. Oh, yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise God. And let me say that we are here through the youth, and you know, we I was started this work when I'm much younger, born in Zion, growing in Zion. Bless the name of the Lord. And myself and our dear minister William was just talking, Minister Brown, bless the name of the Lord. Praise in the Lord. those days, and now it's two different things. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. But we still hold on to our integrity. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. And as we come tonight and we realize that our team is taken from, it's our team, you know, because it's for the whole of us. It doesn't mean young people alone. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord. We only come to back up the young people, but when you come to church, you come to worship God. Oh, yes. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the Lord. Because a true worshiper worship anywhere. And everywhere, bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. And when we look through this theme, we can get a lot of topic from it. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise God. Ephesians chapter 6 and verse 12, bless the name of the Lord, is reminding us and it was it's giving out a warning. Bless the name of the Lord. Oh, yes. Our fight is not against our brother and our sister. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise God. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. I, my, my mind reflects on uh, James chapter 4. Bless the name of the Lord. Yeah. From whence commit war and fighting oh God. among you. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise so let me say, Bridget, let me do not worry ourselves. If you are hot to our place, expect a fight. Yeah. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. If you come to church, expect a fight. Bless the name of the Lord. But let me say, when they are fighting, you just put your thought to God. Because the utter the battle, the sweeter the victory. Bless the name of the Lord. If I said coming up in Zion and I don't get any fight, I would be telling a lie. But I try to hold my head up and Bless the name of the Lord. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Yes. Because fighting is a must. Yes. Somebody must say something about you. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Yes. And let me say to the youth department, there is a time we have a lot of friend enemy. Yes. People will friend you. Yes. And say all manner of evil against you. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Yes. Bless the name of the Lord. Yes. But this we, our brother and our sister, let him be strong in the Lord. And in his power of his might. Bless the name of the Lord. Coming down, but against power of this dark world. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Let me say it before this gentleman who write this lesson, he was a fighter. Bless the name of the Lord. His name was Paul before his name changed to Paul. Oh, Bless the name of the Lord. So anywhere where he, he, he realized and he hear that to the God is having his, you know, having his meeting or doing something good. Then comes uh, Saul present himself. Bless the name of the Lord. But the Lord said, you know, I want to stroke you down. Because I need something from you. Bless the name of the Lord. Praise God. Let me say this out of bad, you get good. Not the only person bad. Pray for him. Bless the name of the Lord. So the Lord has changed his name from Saul to Paul. That Paul could have able to write Ephesians. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Because in that time when he was in the in that uh, the darkness of the world, he was so ignorant. And there's a time we have so many Christian people full of ignorance. My God. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. But let me say now we need to humble ourselves and walk with the Lord. Humble ourselves 
and let the spirit cheer us. Christ will not walk with the proud or the scornful, but humble yourself and walk with God. God bless the God give you back to our minister in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Send everybody with me. Praise God. We pray to put on our speaker tonight. Still, my son shall be.
the Father, who is the head of my life. Praise God unto my elect arch designate Bishop Christopher B. Riley Bishop. Praise God unto Amen. Praise God. Unto all my appointed Pastor Campbell, my Minister Paul, all other officers and members. Linda Donaldson. Praise God, my longtime friend. Praise God, I won't do the same as Minister Boxster. Because the team is saying that we're not fighting against Hallelujah. our brothers and Hallelujah. sisters. Hallelujah. Praise God. So I'm not going to say he's an enemy of mine. Amen. But he's a brother of mine. Hallelujah. And somebody praise God. Bless you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise God. The author tonight, praise God, my bishop already introduced it to you. And then somebody praise God. Praise God. We already know that Paul. Worship the Lord. Hallelujah. And it says in verse 10. 
Yes. Amen. Shall we praise God? Praise the Lord. So above all the things that we're going to tell you, yes. above all, yes. taking the shield of faith yes. with you, yes. that you may be able yes. to quench the fiery dark. Yes. Because the devil is always throwing a dart at us. Yes. When do it? use us as human beings to throw dart against each other. Oh, yes. But when that happened, Paul is telling the Ephesians to listen, you wrestle not against flesh and blood, yes. but against Satan. Yes. Amen. Somebody praise God. Praise the Lord. And he says, take the element of salvation, the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. And then somebody praise God. Hallelujah. So your element is something that protects your head. Yes. So you notice how Paul labor them out the breastplate of righteousness. Yes. You guard your loins and you have on the helmet of salvation. So he's preparing you for battle. Yes. And the sword, which is the word of God. Yes. And then so when some devils and some demons rise upon you, you can able to open your mouth and say don't say the Lord get thee behind me for I know you not somebody praise God praise the Lord Amen. and in verse 80 pray always with all prayer and supplication in spirit and watching there unto with all perseverance and supplication for all saints so let us try to be let it become habitual to pray always. Because some of us love the God when we lay down so we're gone. Yes. But if you know that as a lay down so you're gone, now go and lay down and pray. Shall we praise God? Yes. So that happens to me sometimes, you know, that happens to me sometimes. Yes. So I try not to lay down and pray. Because sometimes you lay down and pray, God, your mind gone, something else, God, think about something else. Yes. But because I know that I get down on my knees and pray. And then somebody praise God. Praise the Lord. And he says in verse 19, and for me that utterance may be given unto me that I may open my mouth boldly and to make known the mystery of the gospel. Shall we praise God? Praise God. So Paul is saying, pray for me that I may able to have utterance and may able to freely speak the gospel of Christ. Amen. Amen. Praise God. For which I in bonds, meaning I'm in prison, yes. that therein I may speak boldly as I ought to speak. Shall we praise God? Praise the Lord. Worship the Lord. And in my closing, it said, Peace be to the brethren, long with faith from God the Father, Lord Jesus Christ. And the last verse I love, Grace be with all them that love our Lord Jesus Christ. In sincerity. Amen. 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 Shall we praise God? Praise the Lord. So Paul wrote to the Ephesians that you know you need to see yourself. Yes. And he strengthened those that remain. Yes. Because he did gain some soul when he was in Ephesus. Yes. Oh, yes. Even yes. though he get the fight, he did gain some soul. Yes. And Paul wanted so much to separate the disciples from those who were walking with the devil. Shall we praise God? Praise so Lord. tonight I'm encouraging you, know, encouraging you to stand fast yes. in the liberty yes. where Christ has made us free yes. and be no more entangled in the yoke of bondage. God bless you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. just as I am.
mighty name of Jesus. I pray, Almighty God, that you will strengthen those that are there. Lord, somebody to renew their feelings. Help somebody to cry out, Almighty God. Help somebody to return to the fold. Lord God, we ask you, God, to sustain us to provide for us the need for my life.